Hello everybody and welcome to this channel. Now if this is your first time to this channel, we welcome you. We'd love you to subscribe to subscribe to this channel, press that subscribe button, also press that like button so other people can get to see this video as well. Leave your comments down below because we would love to hear your comments and anything else you would love us to be talking about. Now, I'm just going to be talking about, um, fairly briefly, about problems uh, or challenges and how to deal with them in a most effective way. I'll share some of my thoughts and uh, what I've learned over the years. Now, when we have problems or challenges, depending on how you want to look at it, is they're there for a reason and also what we must understand about a problem or a challenge is that it has an exp expiration expiration date sorry expiration date meaning that it's not going to last forever it's for a season but whilst we you do have it or uh, you're dealing with a situation that uh, that is challenging you challenging you or it's stopping you from doing what you want to be doing you need to find out a way to best address it now what I've learned is that what you need to be doing, one of the things that you should be considering is what is that problem? What is that challenge? Do you fully understand what you're dealing with? Have you defined it clearly? Now, many times when we get a problem or a challenge, we assume that this is the only way to look at it. We accept one view, one perspective of that problem that we're dealing with without first trying to define it, understand it properly. And in some ways, uh, a quick example is that somebody may say, grass is bad. And that's a fair comment. In some ways, in one perspective, you're saying the grass could be bad. But from whose viewpoint? Now, from a cow's point of view, grass is very good. And from other animals who may use it, they may say grass is the best thing. But from a human's perspective, grass is not something to be considered to be eaten. So, getting definition on what you are dealing with is so important. Break it down to its most fundamental, basic level. Make it so basic that it's almost embarrassing to even ask the question. Uh, this is what I have done. I ask many questions and it's important that you are able to ask questions. So define the problem that you're dealing with, you know, Take many viewpoints, you know, look at it from both sides, from the person who's asking the problem or giving you the problem, or and just define it, make it clear as possible. Because if you're not clear on what you're dealing with, then you will not find the problem, uh, find the solution so easily. And so give yourself that time to define the problem. Make it clear as possible. Use words, use pictures, use audio, whatever you need to understand what you're grappling with, right? And do not be embarrassed about getting definition, getting that clarity in what you're dealing with. Because the more you can do that, it will make your life a lot easier in the process of trying to come up with a suitable solution because there may be more than one solution to this problem that you may be dealing with. And it may be something that you may not have even have considered until you started to really break down the problem or the challenge that you may be facing. And so this also requires you not to be shy or embarrassed. Ask the questions. Understand what you are dealing with. So, quickly, define it. Define exactly what you're dealing with. Get clarity. 
Use words, pictures, audio, whatever you may need. Uh, there's one thing I've not really mentioned. Uh, the tools to use. You can use add electronic or paper, whatever is easier for you. Or a combination of both, whatever. But get that clarity in what you're trying to deal with. So make that situation clear, make it yours. And once you do that, then you're able to move on to other things and to deal with the other uh, process that is required. So I hope this has been of help to you. Until next time, take care now. Bye-bye.